Well, hello there, guys. My name is Arkrector, and welcome back. Welcome back to another episode of Ark Mighty Monsters. Oh, yeah. So, uh, I guess, <laughs> long time no see. It's, uh, it's It has almost been two weeks again. I'm sorry for that, guys, but uh, I didn't really have the motivation to do videos. I'm really sorry for that. But, yeah, uh, you might wonder, Arkrector, what are you going to do today in this episode? Well, today I'm actually going to tame a Brecky. I found a 180 and, you know, if you know me, I love Brekkies. They're probably the coolest creatures in the entire mod of Arc Editions, the collection. And, well, a 180, finding a 180 can take quite some time. And there's one not that far away from my base, actually, in the Redwoods. Which is, which is pretty amazing, not gonna lie. Oh, and by the way, guys. Uh, you might be able to hear it, actually, I got myself a new microphone. This is my first recording with this new microphone, I, so I certainly hope that everything goes as I want it to. And guys, by the way, if you like this video and you want to see more of this, please do me a huge favor and smack that like button. And if you haven't subscribed already and you don't want to miss any of my videos ever again, please subscribe and ring the bell so that you never miss a video of mine ever again. Okay? Okay, sounds about right, sounds about right. So. Uh, the Brecky. I, uh, I'm probably gonna craft the saddle later. Uh, give me the kibble. I turn you off. I already got everything prepared, actually. I stole a bunch of wyvern eggs. This is not where... Ah, uh, there, the kibble. There we go. I got a good amount of extraordinary kibble. I certainly hope that that is enough. If it's not, then, uh, well, I might have to tame him on berries. Oh, wait. I almost forgot the most important thing. Narcotics. Let's see, where are some? Okay, yep, I think that should be enough. Just in case, bring all of them. I can always make more. Let's be honest, harvesting narco berries is not really that hard. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, just in case something attacks. Just in case the Pegomestex comes by and tries to steal my stuff, I do it like this. Okay, so the Brekkies, as I said, not that far away, actually. Do I have a cryopod? I do, good. <laughs> Just checking twice. So, I, uh, whoop. Okay, that was funny. So, um, yeah, guys, I got myself a very good assault rifle to actually deal torpor to this thing because, uh, for those who don't know, you actually have to, well, get him up onto his... You have to attack him, and then after a certain time, he will actually go onto his hind legs and just do a little graveyard just popped up. Okay, because I still have the Halloween event on, but that's beside the point. Uh, so, the main thing with the Brecky is you have to uh, attack him and after some time he will actually, well, get up on his hind legs. And then you basically just have to shoot him in the on the hind legs, you know, between the kneecap and the foot. Uh, and then he basically just collapses and then you can actually feed him the kibble. I have my assault rifle, a really good assault rifle to be more specific, and a, uh, what's it called again, a sniper rifle. Because, well, I just want to use the uh, the Assault Rifle to deal the most Torpor damage as soon as possible. And then I'm going to use the Assault Rifle in the la later, when uh, he's almost knocked out, just in case. Because with the Assault Rifle, you can easily, easily screw up the tame, and I do not want that. Because, you know, I don't really want to waste kibble on a creature that loses, like, what, like, 10% taming effectiveness, so, or maybe even more. So, he should be around here somewhere... Shadows. Uh, I, I like the redwood, but the shadows are kind of annoying. Ah, there he is. I think that's him, right? Okay, Spyglass. Oh, yeah, that is him. Uh, sadly, no spooky Halloween colors. I know Halloween is over, but I, I still have the Halloween event, event on for probably, I guess, like one or two more weeks. Okay, is this a good area? Because when I checked earlier, there was nothing dangerous over here at all. Is there anything dangerous? Let me just harvest these bushes, because I know they will gain, get in my way. Somehow. Destroy the environment, let's go. Okay. Is there anything dangerous? It doesn't look like it, right? It doesn't look like there's anything dangerous, and just look at this massive pile of shit. It's almost as, as tall as my goddamn Atlas Kodiak, holy crap. No pun intended. Uh, let's see... I'm just gonna check twice, because I don't want anything to interrupt me. I could also try to look him down to the obelisk, you know, to the shores, because it's very flat down there. I mean, this is acceptable, but I uh, don't really want to get interrupted by literally anything. 
Are there Polovias on the ground? Because Polovias don't attack Kodiaks. Hmm. Oh, Trudons! No! No! I just saw it. Lord, forgive me. I just killed a red panda that was actually green. The red panda is also the kind of the, this little small creature that I have on my shoulders, guys. It's, uh, oh, that's sad. Big sad. Everyone right have in the chat for the green red panda. Hmm. Okay. Should I just, you know what, I'm just going to destroy these rocks because I know they will get in my way. Okay. So, you have to go as well, good sir. All right, all right, good, good. Uh, anything else that is dangerous, that might be dangerous or something. Okay, something just exploded over there. I'm just going to take a quick look what that might be. That might have been something dangerous. You're just, I, don't, I don't need these items, so I'm going to drop them on the ground. You're going to stay here, okay? Don't despawn, I swear. Okay, what the hell exploded over here? Something... Okay, an Innistrand Sevia. That will get in my way, for sure. Oh, I one-shot at him. Oh, lucky me. Because these things, they inflict you with a very nasty disease that will drain your health down. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, there's another brick. Oh, man, this is... This one has even cooler colors. What level are you, boy? Level 30. Disgrace. Why did you even spawn? Okay. I don't see anything dangerous as of right now. Which is good. But we all know this game. And I know that if I try to tame this thing right now, there will something bad will happen. I know. I can tell. But let's just hope nothing bad happens, okay? Okay. So, wish me luck, everyone. Okay, so I have my magnifying glass. I have that. I have my sniper rifle and my assault rifle. Just, just look at that. Holy shit! Still no pun intended. Oh, hello, little scarecrow. Okay. Uh, by the way, bear, before you do anything, go on passive. Okay, thanks. Okay, I deal a lot of damage towards this dude. Come on, get on your hind legs. Come on. Get on your hind legs. Get on your hind legs, boy. Come on. Yeah, I know that you want to stomp on me. Come on, get on your hind legs. Oh, this is so scary. Look at how massive this thing is. Yeah, there we go. Okay, for some reason he's stuck. Yeah, you just want to sh shoot right between the... The kneecap and the foot, because you do less damage, but a lot of torpor. Oh, fuck, nope. Woo! The best thing that you can do on this is literally just go behind him. I mean, I have good armor. I don't know how much damage I can take from this dude, though. Because this storm attack is destructive. Let me reload this. Okay, I definitely need to check how much torp I did to him. Come on. I know that you want to stomp on me. Come on. I know this is a small space, but just keep it going. Keep it going. Keep it going. Come on. He go no, he's not going for my bear, good. Wait. Wait, is he already- No, 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 please don't tell me I screwed up the tame. I definitely screwed up the tame, didn't I? I definitely hit him afterward. Oh, fuck! Please don't- Okay. There's only one way to figure that out. You get- Come on. Ooh, okay, that was- That was really fast. This- No, not, not you. This assault rifle is really strong. Oh. This weapon is strong. I mean, if... Okay, I mean, if I accidentally hit him afterwards, so be it. Okay, just give me, like... Okay, give me... You know what? Give, give me, like, a... 
I say two. So I can see how much... Uh, if I hit him by accident, because if that's the case, then I know that I need to be more careful. I did not drain that much health on him, which is perfect. And you see the uh, torpidity is actually draining quite fast on this dude, so... Um, even if I screwed up the tame, it shouldn't take that long for him to wake up. Please just tell me that I didn't screw it up. Please just tell me I didn't screw it up. I probably screwed it up, didn't I? Oh, man. How much torpid do you even have? Okay, I cannot see it from here. How much torpor? Come on, I want to see it. But hitbox. 29k. Okay, that's a good amount, actually. I've, okay, that... Uh, okay. I mean, if I screwed up the tame, that's not really big of a deal. I can easily do that again. I just need to be more careful. Oh, you, you little trudon. Get the hell out of here. Oh! Oh! Oh, my lord, Gigantoraptor. Don't scare me like that, please. I love you, but... Oh, God. Don't do that ever again, please. Okay, okay. Come on, eat something. Okay, I need to kill that dude. I need to kill that uh, Microraptor over there. Microraptor Trudon. Oh, God. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, my God. They're just like fucking raptors. You little... Oh, okay. I'm going to take a nap, probably. Yep. Yep, good night. They're just like fucking raptors. They hit you and they just... They get just just get right up to your face and you can't hit them with any of your weapons. That's just annoying, okay? Okay, at least my torp is running relatively quick. Don't mind me, I'm just sleeping. Did I hurt an eating animation? With the break, he just ate something. Please, by the love of the Ark Gods. Please let it be good. Okay, okay, you get over here. Okay, please. Still hasn't even eaten anything. Okay, that's interesting. Oh man, a Bintron would be very useful in right now. Oh, hey, hey. No, okay, I'm stuck on his tail. Come on, whoop. Okay, it doesn't work like that. Sad. Okay, so now we know that the assault rifle is incredible powerful. And uh, it just deals a lot of torpor to these things. Holy crap. I just wanna... I don't know when would he eat. Hmm. Just look how massive these things are. Holy macaroni. Yep, I screwed up the tame. I screwed up the I screwed up the tame. He needs to wake up again. Oh man. Ah, uh, big sad. Okay, yeah, because 75 levels, that's He would get like if I had 100 percent taming effectiveness, he would get, I believe, plus 80. So yeah, let me just grab this out of his inventory and uh let him wake up. So guys, that was a big fail. Um, I'm gonna try that again after he woke up, and I'm gonna see you guys later. And there we go, he falls again! The Titan has fallen once more, and this time I didn't screw it up. Oh. Oh, okay. I definitely didn't screw it up this time. You get close to here, look at him. Look at him. His knees. His knees are completely destroyed. I just removed your knees, I completely demolished your legs, and now you need to be my friend. Have fun. I know it sucks, but this is how life works. Okay, okay, good. So you get in here, you get in here. Oh yes, it works. Oh yes. Oh wait, what? You're already so starved? Okay, that, that that's nice. Let's see, you're at 44%, I still have 8 kibble left. That's definitely enough. Okay, guys, this is amazing. This thing is finally knocked out. So, I'm gonna see you guys when this Goliath is finally awake and belongs to us. Okay? Sounds right? Sounds about right, right? Okay, see you later. And we're back, guys. As you can see, we're walking through this big old lake because this is a thing that the Brecky can actually do. 
He doesn't really swim, and as far as I know, he can walk on the bottom of a lake or even the ocean, as long as his, uh, his head is like above the, the surface, which is pretty nice. Let me just sprint through this. Yeah, let's just uh, like look. He's still not swimming. <laughs> this is hilarious. Just just look at this. It's so funny. And this okay, I haven't I never really realized how deep this lake is. Holy crap, because this thing like this thing towers over my goddamn house, which is inside of a tree. Okay, that's interesting. Okay, let's see how strong you are. Yeah, uh, that boy that just died. Oh, hello, Acro, what's up? Okay, that's a lot of damage. Already. That's not even imprinted or leveled. But now, let's go with a big attack first. So, for that you have to press C. And then, he basically just stands like that. You can move like that. And then you just have to press uh, left-click again. And then he does this. Let's go. Okay, how much damage was... That was 8k damage. Well, that was a lot of damage. 8k. Uh, he also has a right click, which is, if I'm not wrong, a kick. Yeah, exactly, a kick. Which harvests berries. And, well, control is the raw. The fear raw. Goodbye. Run away or fly away. You can't escape from me. Goodbye, Microraptor. So this thing is just a, a a goddamn titan, as you can see. It's it's gigantic. Holy man. Oh, and by the way, if you press R, please don't eat my. Okay, good. If you press R, you see you can just switch between the the harvesting uh, options. So there was wood, thatch, berries, stone, and metal. For example, now if I hit this rock, I think I should get more metal than anything else. Okay, almost. So. You need to use that on an actual metal node. Let's see if I can find one. There should be one, some over there. Oh man, this is so slow, so uh, you can expect that this part will be heavily edited. For for my standards, at least. For Mighty Monster standards. Okay, uh, yeah, because you see how slow it is. Um, okay, you already got two levels. Uh, you got 31k health. That's already a lot. Uh, hmm. I say, like... Oh god, we're already at 4k. Uh, excuse me, 50k. Then something into stam, melee damage, and movement. Okay, movement speed is not really worth it, so. We definitely want to get an imprinted one one day. Hello, little piggy. I definitely want to go into the snow biome because there's so much that we can actually kill. Uh, speaking of snow biome, I was actually waiting for the uh, woolly variant for this. Of this uh, of the break to come out because well yeah there is a woolly variant that is uh, being worked on and it's look it looks really cool already it has well fur on it it has new color patterns which looks really awesome and um, it's very similar to the scorched acro which is kind of annoying because as you guys know I tamed an acro like a month ago and after I tamed the acro I, I believe like two weeks after that the the mod developer of this mod actually released the scorched acro which is technically just a variant that has a new skin uh, but it looks way cooler in my opinion okay oh my, I, I want to see how much metal this dude can harvest because if he can harvest more metal than my glacier king crab then uh, the glacier king crab can probably just stop working for me come on okay no that wasn't it oh no no, it's not really better, because my Glacier King Crab harvests way more metal. Okay, yeah, that's pretty good. I think the main thing about the Brecky is the fact that he can, like, harvest anything. And this is why he, and the, and the fact that he's so strong and bulky and, you know, tanky. And I think this is why he is one of the better harvesters, but he's definitely, definitely not the best harvesters in my mod pack. My current best harvester would be the, uh... The Glacier King Crab that I tamed in the last episode. Okay. Okay, you know what, guys? I... First of all, I'm gonna give him levels. Eight more levels. Okay, yeah. Uh, more melee damage. I... Guess I'm gonna see you later as soon as we've actually reached the snow biome and can find some bigger stuff to kill. Okay? Okay. Alright, we finally found some new victims. 
Let's slowly approach them. Hey guys, I wanna s Okay, why am I freezing here? I have full on fur on. Leave me alone, wolves. Okay, time to smack you. I like your cut, G. Come on. Okay then, okay then, just don't slam. There we go, 13k. Oh, by the way, uh, this little... Wait, give, let me give him levels. There we go. Yeah, this little icon in uh, the top right corner, you know, this timer. That's uh, the timer whenever you... Uh, th this timer, timer starts whenever you do one of these big stomp attacks. Because they're... Yeah, you need to wait whenever you want to use the, one of these big storms. I think like 30 seconds or something. Which is acceptable. Why am I freezing? It is acceptable, but... Um, yeah, it's very balanced, which I absolutely adore. Why am I freezing over here? I have full-on fur on, right? I have full fur on. Why the hell am I freezing? Let me kill you, Mammoth. Speaking of mammoths, the mammoth DLC is coming out tomorrow, which is just amazing, guys. I can't wait for the for that. Come on, die! They're gonna stomp on you. This is not even an imprint. This is not even an imprinted one. And I know, guys, I could probably go all out and try to kill a a, a giga because I know that there are a few on this map, but I don't really want to risk it. I mean, I can scare them away, but come on, what the hell? Wait, is that a fire wyvern? It is a fire wyvern. What the hell? What is fire wyvern doing over here? Hey, hey, you're not. You don't belong here. No. Hey, you don't belong here. What the hell? Why the hell is he over here? Did he flew all the way over here from the trench? Come on, I, I, you don't belong here. Okay, fire damage. Thanks. All right, you know what? I'm just gonna wait for the perfect moment. Okay, weird glitch. Come on, get stuck somewhere. Come on, let me, let me. Yes. Okay, <laughs> you're gone. Why was there a fire weapon though? That doesn't make any sense. Hello, Barrioth. What's up? Uh, by the way, this dude is from the the Barrioth down there is from a private mod. Okay. Okay, good. Have fun hitting stuff. Look at that. I'm literally... Like, at the the head of this dude is above the goddamn flying RGs. This thing is amazing. I, I love brekkies. I just adore them in any way, shape, or form. Okay, can I find, like, an area with a lot of mammoths? There should be a lot over here, right? I mean, I'm very close. Uh, I need some food and some water, apparently. Yeah, no, not over here, because usually this area is just swarmed by mammoths. Okay, I mean, there are a few. Hey, are those Emphasions? Those are Emphasions. Let me just stomp on this one. And all the other mammoths should probably run towards me. Just everything into melee damage, because with 15k health, you're pretty good to go. The heck? Oh, hi, Tiggy, what's up? And stomp. Let's go. I love the stomp. And I just broke the. I just. I was hitting that mammoth over there. Well, I just broke your spines. Have fun. Uh, he is. Okay, this mammoth is just trying to attack the Tiggy over there, the Tigrex. Well, have fun with that, boy. Okay. Okay, can I find something interesting to kill? That is not something that can kill me. You know, something like a Devil Joe or something that... Because Devil Joes can't kill me. They can kill me, sadly. But yeah, guys, this is not even an imprinted one, and I already have... This one already has, like, 50k health and uh, deals so much damage. And I just love the fact that you sit on his head. Look at that. In PvP, you could easily get sniped off, but that's beside the point. You, This is amazing. And hello, Legiana. Alright. Oh, wait, there are more mammoths. I want to stomp on them. You won't, gonna, you won't know what hit you. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Ugh. Let me hit you. There we go. 
And all of them should charge towards me. <laughs> Goodbye, everyone. And I accidentally killed a level 174. Ah, I mean, it's not really that hard to find mammoths on this map, let's be honest. I only got one level from that. Disappointment. Okay. I just... The only thing that I leave behind me is a pile of corpses. Well, at least the Emphasians have fun. And the dire wolves. I'm almost there, boys. I'm almost there, okay? I can almost stomp on you. Come on. Doesn't take that long anymore. Let's go. Ugh. Wait, I can have a meet with this dude? I had no idea. Honestly. Whoops, nope. Nope, goodbye. <laughs> oh god, this is funny. Okay, there are two Legianas, like, right, very close to my base, actually. Ah, I probably got, I gonna take care of those later. Because they're just fighting against the Mammoth and it's going to be very hard to hit them. Uh, melee damage, or should I try? Should I at least try? Ah, I gonna care, I gonna, yeah, no, I gonna kill those later. Because I, yeah, I don't really think, I don't really know what I can do at this point anymore. I mean, I could try fight against those things, but they're just gonna freeze me. And I don't really love, want that right now. So I guess I'm gonna end the video right here, guys. Um, so yeah, guys, if you enjoyed this video, please just smack that like button. And if you haven't subscribed already, and you don't want to miss any of my content ever again, just subscribe and ring the bell, so that you, as I said, never miss a video of mine ever again. Have a beautiful and amazing day. I'm going to see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.